Here we go, folks. What's going on everyone? Shred every day coming back at you with another video. Um, today, I'm really excited. I am currently in the state of Wyoming. And uh, to give a little background, I was born in Colorado. So skiing is just kind of what you do. And I think Wyoming, I mean, Jackson Hole gets a lot of uh, press and a lot of, you know, interest. And it's a great mountain, don't get me wrong. But I wanted to come to Wyoming and do some reviews of some smaller resorts that are really good to come check out. So today we are at Snowy Range, Wyoming. It's right out of Centennial, probably about, you know, I'll put the map over here. I think my GPS said I'm like 40 minutes from Laramie. Um, maybe even not that much. Like I said, I'll put it here. But you've got Laramie, and then um, to get here, you can fly into Denver. It's about a two and a half hour drive from Denver uh, International Airport, or you can fly into Cheyenne. Um, so it's pretty handy to get to, actually. It's a great place uh, so far. Um, actually, I met uh, the owners, Becky and Aaron. Just awesome people, great to talk to. They kind of talked to me about the mountain and different things like that. So shout out to them. Thanks so much for letting me film here. And uh, yeah, let's shred some runs and check out this great place. Have anything to say? Oh, it's a good day. Yeah, good, good day. day. Good day. Snow one, got good powder. Good powder. All right, folks, I am joined today with Sister Shred. Huh? Do you have any words of wisdom? No. No? Really. No, I don't get the camera shot. stay out of your way. <laughs> yes, she's actually the speed demon of the family, so it's true. Yeah, but we're going to shred some runs. We're going to check out the Pioneer Lift and the Bunny Hill first, right? And then we'll move on to bigger and better things. Yep. Stay tuned. Show the map right here. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'll put I'll put the map over my face. But uh, it's over. If you're looking at the mountain, it's all the way on the left. It's for the beginner hill, right? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So we have four categories. Okay. Steepness, width, um, conditions, and fun. Okay. You're gonna give it five out of five, four out of five. You know, whatever you think. So as far as width, what would you give this beginner run? I would give it a five. Boom. Yeah, it's nice and wide. It Don't is. Don't feel like you're going to run into things or people. Correct. Yeah. And then, let's see. So we did width, right? Yeah. 
And then steepness, I would give it probably a five out of yeah. five as well. Yeah, I'd give it a, a four or five. It's a little steep at the top, but after that, it's great. Yeah, okay, four out of, yeah, that's fair. That's fair. And uh, which will lead into the conditions part. This is my opinion. Up at the top, there's a little bit of wind, and so it kind of blows that top layer of snow off. And it makes it a little bit icy. Yeah. So for conditions, I would give it a four out of five. I'd give it a four, yeah. Four out of five. Lastly, the amount of fun you had. I give it a five. It's a really good beginner uh, run, I think. Yeah, yeah. Boom. So on average, if you're coming to learn how to ski or kind of refresh some stuff, I would come check out the beginner lift, pioneer lift. I think it's pioneer lift. Yeah. Um, and uh, come check out that if you're trying to to get your legs under you. So we'll keep on shredding and stay tuned. Sundance run. Let's go. Am I leading it? All right, folks, so we're out here with Father Shred. We're kind of doing a family day. Um, so you'll hear different folks reviewing the things. We are just skied Sundance. And this is the MRI, the Mid Run Interview. Hopefully it doesn't give you an MRI, but... Oh, I mean... Yeah, hopefully not. Yeah, that'd be bad. But uh, I thought it'd be a funny pun. So we did Sundance, it's listed as a blue. Yes. What do you think about the steepness? You know, at the top, it's got, uh, it'll definitely, if you're kind of a beginning, intermediate kind of skier, definitely get your uh, oh, adrenaline yeah. running there, you know? Yeah. Uh, there's Honestly, a few moguls at the top. Yep. Honestly, I've been on certain, or I've been to certain ski resorts where they would have listed that probably as a black. Okay. But I think it's a fantastic blue myself. Oh, it was exhilarating. It was so yeah. fun off the top. It, uh, it's got, got a lot of width to it, you know? Oh, so, yeah. So you're not, you don't feel like you're... Right. Even though it's steep, you don't feel like you're going to run into a right. tree on the side of the lift, you know? You don't have that sense of impending doom. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. So I would say for width, five out of five. It's yeah. it's fantastic. Absolutely. The uh, the steepness, I would give it probably. Honestly, I really liked it, so I'm going to go I with a five really out of five. I really liked it. I, it was a really fun run. Yeah, really I would give it five out of five. Um, conditions, it's snowing, as you can see. Hopefully, I so mean, so we got about two to three inches of powder on the ground, yeah. and. More Over. promise to come. Oh, yeah. So it's just the conditions are great. Yeah. So I would give the conditions today a five out of five as well. I could see knocking it down to maybe a three or four out of five if it had been a while since they'd had snow. Yeah. Um, but currently five out of five. Lastly, the amount of fun. Oh, awesome. I, I mean, you can't get any more fun. Five out of five. Yeah. Tremendous run. So now you have it. If you come to Sun, or excuse me, if you come to Snowy Range, Come over to the Sundance, and there's a path from Pioneer Lift down to Sundance Lift. It's a beautiful run as well, but this area is absolutely amazing. So come check out the Sundance Lift when you come visit. All right. Yeah, go ahead. So let's talk just for a minute about the Sundance Lift. It's a good long lift. Uh, takes you pretty much up to the top of the mountain. Uh, not very crowded. It's a three-person chair. Uh, and has pretty good speed on it, so you don't spend a lot of time on the lift, Correct. and you can spend more time skiing. Yeah, and it is nice. I think it's the nicest lift they have here. I think it is, yes. Yeah, um, and it's a three-person, like you said, and I think it accesses some of the most exciting terrain on the mountain. I would say either Sundance or the chute lift. Those are the two most exciting, if you're more like intermediate advanced. And thanks so much for, for watching the videos and showing support. The channel is actually, I'm amazed, it's actually growing. Our subscribers keep on going up and uh, it's all because of viewers like you. So make sure to subscribe to the channel if you want to see more shredding. Comments, leave comments down below. If you want to say something, questions, things I should do, things I shouldn't do, life advice, if you've got a used car you need to sell, no, I'm kidding. Lastly, smash that like button if you enjoy the content. And uh, you know, at the end of the day, keep shredding every day and we'll catch you on the next one.